a Chinese researcher claims to have made the world's first gene-edited babies. Although not independently proven, He Jiankui says he altered the DNA of baby twin girls to help them resist HIV infection. The world has moved on to the stage for embryo genome editing. There will be someone somewhere who is doing this. If it's not me, it's someone else. He said he edited embryos for seven couples during in vitro fertilization. He claims the baby twin girls successfully carried copies of the edited genes when they were born. The gene editing was done using a tool called CRISPR-Cas9. CRISPR allows scientists to precisely target and edit DNA in order to disable or enhance specific genes. CRISPR is a guide molecule made of RNA that allows a specific site of interest on the DNA double helix to be targeted. The RNA molecule is attached to a bacterial enzyme called Cas9, which works as a pair of molecular scissors to cut the DNA at the exact point required. This allows scientists to cut, paste, and delete single letters of genetic code. Some argue that the gene editing tool has the potential to treat diseases, but many scientists are worried about the ethics and dangers of these kinds of experiments. We still have a lot of work to do to prove and establish that the procedure is actually safe. I would say that no babies should be born um, at this point in time following the use of this technology. It's simply too early, too premature. Scientists are worried about the permanent changes or unwanted mutations gene editing may have on a person's DNA and the DNA of future generations to come. To learn more about CRISPR technology, visit globalnews.ca. I'm Emanuela Campanella.